And we're live. It's Adam Robinson, founder and CEO of Retention.com, and we are here on another beautiful Friday afternoon in Austin, Texas, and that means it is work in public. Five short minutes of something that I'm working on at the company. If you're following on LinkedIn, follow us. I'll put one out every week. YouTube, same deal. You get another one of these every week. So the biggest hack that I've ever seen, and I'm pretty proud of myself for doing this, is landing our dream candidates with this incredible inbound engine that I think every founder and CEO should be doing. So the problem we were trying to solve is getting from six people, which we've been to two and a half for two and a half years, to 25 people in eight weeks. And really the problem with that is how could you possibly explain everything that somebody would want or need to know about the opportunity that you are trying to get them to join through the interview process? You just can't. Like you can't put it all up on social media. It, I was of the view that if I could just get somebody to listen to me talk about what we're doing for like half an hour or an hour, um, they would be sold, right? So here's what I did. I posted, and I'll link to it, the Join Our Team podcast. It's 11 videos. They're like five minutes each on our websites, right? And it's things like, what's up at retention.com today? Our origin story and mission, absurd traction, our core team, our product, how we sell it, and why we're crushing. Why will retention.com will always be a remote company? Work life balance at retention.com, above market compensation. Why I just spent 800 grand in dom domain? Why retention.com will never take venture capital? And the road to 100 million ARR. So here was what we did. When we got a bite from a candidate, we would send them a video. So like one five minute video from Adam talking about the opportunity. Turns out that video was that five minute video, but it was also this 11 episode playlist. So these candidates who are the right candidates hear me talking about this, they get excited about it, and then they listen to me for an hour talk about the most exciting parts of the business, right? The right candidate watches them all. And as a pro tip, if you're thinking about doing this, Alex Hermosi says, I'm not trying to sell you anything. At the end of his podcast intro, I do this, and we're live at the beginning of every single thing that I, I do. And I know people are watching my stuff because I get on with our new customers, or sorry, customers. I get on with our new employees. They see the background or whatever, and they see the mic, and they say it to me, and it's like hilarious. And how, what inspired me to make this particular episode of uh, Work in Public? We just landed this VP sales candidate. I'm not sure if we're allowed to announce the name or whatever, but like, I just can't believe how good he is. And he told me his words, I made the mistake of watching this on my vacation in Mexico. I did not sleep the entire night, right? What an incredible medium video is. What an incredible thing a YouTube playlist is, right? Like it gives me the ability to basically get somebody to listen to me talk about this for an hour. They feel like they know me afterwards. Um, I've had some success doing this with a, a similar strategy, right? When we started our company and you can fit, you can see the play, this isn't the exact playlist cause we lost it, but, um, there is the, the get emails playlist. I need to add it to our, to our YouTube channel. Actually, I'll add it. But basically we were struggling with a credibility battle when we started get emails. It was like resolving anonymous web drive traffic to deliverable emails. I basically had Helen and I sitting in the old office, which looked really cool. And there were like people behind us working. And it's, there was a link to podcast in the nav of the website. And I would just, everybody would click it because like, oh, this company has a podcast. They would hit this YouTube page and it was just a podcast. It said episode one. Well, how is this legal? Like it's answering all of the sales questions that people had. And we get thousands of views. Um, so people like pre-warmed themselves up before they even got in a demo. Same idea here, and this is why I wanted to do it. I would highly recommend that strategy. Make the videos everything that you think is unique about your business. That's step one. Step two, whatever your recruiting pipeline is, whoever's doing the interviewing, just send them the five-minute video uh, when you get a warm lead. And then Bob's your uncle after that. That is work in public. Episode number nine, the best recruiting hack I have ever seen. I will see you next Friday. It will be the day after Thanksgiving. I will be in a coma. Um, oh, no, wait. This is the day after Thanksgiving. Oh, dear. <laughs> I'm making him a week early. Don't tell anybody. Holler.